Okay, the school year is underway for many, and while classes at Shorter College don't start until next week, today was a huge day. For the first time in 20 years, students were able to move into on-campus dorms. THV 11's Jalissa Garza joins us with a closer look at the new additions. Yeah, Faith, Craig, in February, the college broke ground on the new dorms, and six months later, dozens of students are moving in, getting ready for the school year. This represents such a milestone uh, in the history of the college. Shorter College is a school full of history, dating back to 1886. And now, for the first time in nearly two decades, on-campus living is back. So today is move-in day uh, for the dormitory, and so we have approximately 50 young people and their families on campus processing in. President Jerome Green says bringing housing back is something important for the college. Campus life is an essential part of the college experience in terms of getting student engagement and the student immersing themselves in uh, this particular program uh, to prepare for the rest of their life. The 50 students who will be living here are part of the basketball teams and choir. Students like Kayla Kimbrough. I am a incoming freshman. Kimbrough says the brand new dorms along with the basketball team helped her make the choice to come to Shorter. Being able to come in to like a new dorm, it was just a really like, like set my decision on it. She says she's excited to be able to connect with her teammates in a space they'll all be calling home. Just really just like being able to get like a, a team chemistry and learn more about the girls and just be able to like have a bond. President Green says soon more students will be able to have the same opportunity. Uh, it is our objective to build two, two more dormitories. As we fill this one, then we'll look to fill the next one until we can have a residential population that live on campus of, of about 300. President Green tells me there is so much more in store for the college with plans of a new technology campus in the works as well as a STEM education program.